I don't know if we really change any, anything besides just like making sure we manage ourselves and try to take short shifts and stuff. Uh, I thought it was a good opportunity for, for guys to get more ice time and showcase themselves even more. And, um, you know, I don't think we really have to change our mindset too much, but I actually think it, you know, D played pretty well um, for the most part because uh, we're out there and we're rolling. You don't think as much and you're constantly going out there. So, um, yeah, I thought it was... Uh, it was pretty good. We we did a decent job managing it. A couple, a couple long shifts there in the third, but <clears throat> other than that, it was okay. Uh, three three heading into the third period. Kind of same situation with the, in the Philly game, tied in and third. What would you guys have done better in that period? Um, to be honest, I don't know right now. Um, just thinking back on the goals, there were a couple point shots. Um, I don't know what, where the where the breakdowns really happened, um, whether they were up top or down low. I, I really don't know. Um, I thought we, you know, considering being down some guys and uh, on the back end, I, I thought our third period wasn't wasn't too bad. But like like you said, those two goals right away like really um, really hurt us. Uh, but I have to go back and I'm sorry, I can't really give you a definitive answer. I, I have to go back and, and see what happened, and we're going to look at video and, and see what we could have done better. But I thought our mindset was, you know, pretty good from the start of the start of the period. Just um, just an unfortunate uh, two goals that they had early there that really, you know, made us have to chase the game. Mario, kind of coming right off of that, you guys were consistently coming back from down one all game. With the mindset, how how much does that second goal specifically and the third impact that uh, when you're down by two instead of down by one? Well, yeah, I mean, um, it's easier to come back from from one goal deficit than, than two, so uh, <clears throat> that that stung a little bit. Um, I don't think we gave up uh, for the most part, but it definitely it makes it harder to, ca to catch up, and you know they're going to obviously do a better job of playing defense when, when they know they have a two-goal lead and they don't necessarily need another another goal. So um, that makes it even harder to score. So, yeah, that wasn't easy. Um, we're on both sides of it, though. We had the lead 2-2-1. Two, two, um, so we were chasing the game at one point. We are leading the game at, at another. So um, just a, a bunch of change turn of events there. and um, But, yeah, the, the two-goal dagger uh, really uh, really hurt us, our confidence coming back there, I think, in, this, in the third period. How scary was a Macau's injury, and how surprised were you to see him back you know, after a couple minutes? Yeah, I didn't really see the, what happened, so I didn't. I didn't get the clip. Uh, his reaction, um, yeah, it didn't look too good. Um, and then once we saw him back, we were pretty relieved. So, uh, I mean, it was maybe a scare for for two minutes, and then when they saw him back on the bench, we knew he was fine. What's he meant to you guys, both uh, on and off the ice this season? Yeah, he's huge for our group. Um, Obviously, it's his play on the ice is pretty evident uh, what he can do for us and, and what he's done in this league. And he's going to be a huge part of this, you know, huge part of this team. And he has been this year um, and uh, keeping us positive and keeping us going. Um, you know, his, his off ice, he's just um, one of the classiest guys I know. Uh, he's pretty quiet, but, uh, you know, he's never he's never negative. He's always positive and he brings that good energy. And, um, you know, we're very fortunate to have him in our locker room. Speaking of yourself, uh, I uh, asked you about this, you know, a month or so ago. The trade deadline passed. Uh, you know, mm -hmm. relieved that you're still here. Relieved that that's passed. That you don't have to worry about that. Yeah, yeah that that time, you know, any year is uh, is uh, you know builds up a lot of emotion. Um, you know, you, you sometimes you pick up guys and you're excited, and then you lose guys, and you know it's a sad sad moment. And obviously, we know who we um, we lost this year, and. Um, it sucks. It stung, uh, but now we move on because it is part of the sport, and um, you know it does. I do feel a sense of, you know, it's always nice to know where where you're going to be for, for an extended period of time. So it's it's nice to have some, you know, uh, you know confidence that I know I'm going to be here. And um, yeah, I think that a lot of guys in this room uh, feel that sense of relief as well. Uh, and um, you know, it's important that we we show that on the ice with these next 17 